Good morning, my dear lovely children. Welcome to our phonics lesson. Our objective for today is learners will be able to review the sound G and identify the correct formation. And our outcomes are, at the end of the lesson, learners are able to identify G sound and they will know the correct formation of the phonic sound G. Look at this picture, children. Can you tell me what is the name of this picture? Yes, you're right. It is grass. What is the beginning sound of grass? Well done. It is G. Okay, children. Now it's time to write the sound G. So from top, we will come down and then come down and a curve. Very good. Can we write it again? Come on. Start from the top. Can you use your fingers? Come on. Start from the top. Go round and then come down and a curve. Good job. Now, can you think of some more objects that begins with G sound? Let's see what do we have here. We have a goat, grass, guitar, grapes. Can you think some more G pictures and tell your mama? Look at these words. They all have G in the beginning. G is a plain line round letter. It starts just like the letter C. Start on the plain line. Fly back on the plain line. Go down and around to the grass line. Up to the plain line. And all the way down to the worm line. Then make a curve. G, game, G. Start on the plain line. Fly back on the plain line. Go down and around to the grass line. Go up to the plain line and all the way down to the worm line. And make a curve. Start on the plain line. Fly back on the plain line. Go down and around to the grass line. Up to the plain line and all the way down to the worm line with a curve. I do not pick up my marker when I make the letter G. Start on the plain line, fly back, go down and around to the grass line, up to the plain line, and all the way down to the worm line, and make a curve. G, game, G. Your turn. Okay, children, now it's reflection time. So, what did you learn today? Let's practice to trace and write G sound. Take your literacy workbook, turn to page 33. Say the sound G and trace and write. Practice writing G in your four-line notebook. Bye-bye, children. See you next time.